Have you ever thought that the rocks beneath your feet might be more dangerous than a weapon? That something as ordinary as a shiny crystal or a colorful stone could carry enough poison, radiation, or explosive potential to change your life forever? It sounds like science fiction, but it is not. Around the world, there are minerals so deadly that miners have lost their lives handling them, and collectors have been poisoned simply by keeping them at home. These aren't just pretty stones. They are ticking time bombs created by nature itself. And by the end of this video, you'll discover the most dangerous mineral of all, one that is invisible, unstoppable, and terrifying beyond imagination. Let's start with the basics. Minerals are the building blocks of the earth. They shape mountains, fuel industries, and decorate jewelry stores. But not every mineral is safe to touch or admire. Some carry toxins, others release invisible gases, and a few can even glow with radiation strong enough to burn through flesh. What looks beautiful on the surface can hide the darkest secrets underground. One of the most infamous examples is arsenoporite. At first glance, it looks harmless, a metallic crystal with a silvery shine. But crack it open, and it releases arsenic. Just a small amount can poison water, soil, and anyone who dares to breathe its dust. During the gold rush, miners often encountered arsenoporite while chasing veins of gold. Some didn't survive long enough to enjoy their riches. Then there's cinnabar, the mineral source of mercury. For centuries, it was crushed to produce a bright red pigment used in paints and decorations. Artists loved it because of its beauty. But many of them paid the price with trembling hands, failing health and early death. The same mineral that painted palaces also painted coffins. Imagine holding something that glows with danger. Uraninite is one of those. It contains uranium, the same element that powers nuclear reactors and weapons. To look at it is to stare at the raw heart of radiation. Scientists who studied it in the early days didn't understand how deadly it was. Some carried samples in their pockets, unknowingly burning themselves with invisible rays. But radiation isn't always obvious. Take torbernite, a mineral so green and crystal-like that it could easily fool you into thinking it's emerald. Yet inside its fragile beauty is radioactive uranium. Collectors who store it in cabinets sometimes don't realize the slow danger seeping through the glass. It is a mineral that can poison a room without ever moving. Some minerals kill silently by suffocating you. Take Realgar, another arsenic-based crystal. In the dark, it can glow red like fire, which made ancient alchemists believe it was magical. But when heated or left to weather, it releases toxic fumes that can kill if inhaled. Imagine working in a mine filled with invisible poison in the air. For many, that wasn't imagination. It was their last breath. Other minerals aren't toxic in a chemical sense, but deadly in how they attack your lungs. Crocodilite, known as blue asbestos, is one of the most dangerous. Its fibers are so fine they can float in the air for hours. Once inside the lungs, they pierce tissue and stay there forever, leading to cancer and other fatal diseases. Entire towns built around asbestos mines became graveyards of suffering. What was once marketed as a miracle material for insulation turned into a silent killer that still haunts us today. But sometimes the danger is explosive. Stibnite, a mineral rich in antimony, has long silver-gray crystals that look like frozen spears. Beautiful, but unstable. In certain conditions, stibnite can react violently. In the past, it was even used to make fireworks and explosives. Miners handling it without care risked being blown apart by nature's own weapons. Another mineral with a deadly history is galena, the main source of lead. Its shiny, cube-like crystals are attractive, but they contain toxic lead that can damage the brain and nervous system. 
Ancient civilizations used galena to make makeup, unknowingly painting poison on their faces. Beauty literally came at the cost of health. If you think water makes things safer, think again. Gypsum is harmless, but fluorite can release fluorine gas when exposed to acids. Fluorine is so reactive, it can burn skin instantly, dissolve glass, and corrode almost anything it touches. Imagine a mineral that holds inside it the potential to unleash one of the most aggressive elements in existence. That's fluorite's hidden danger. Moving into the realm of radioactive nightmares, automite looks like a glowing yellow-green crystal, almost fluorescent. To collectors, it's dazzling. But its uranium content makes it a source of constant radiation. Keep it close for long enough, and your body will pay the price with sickness that creeps in slowly, silently, and fatally. And then we have pyrite, the famous fool's gold. At first glance, pyrite doesn't seem too dangerous. Miners laughed at those who confused it with real gold. But pyrite has a dark side. When it weathers, it produces sulfuric acid. In abandoned mines, this reaction creates toxic waters that can kill fish, destroy ecosystems, and poison rivers for miles. Fool's gold, it turns out, is no joke. Even more sinister is chalcanthite, a bright blue crystal that looks like candy. Children who stumbled upon it sometimes tried to taste it. That was a fatal mistake. Chalcanthite dissolves in water, creating a poisonous solution filled with copper sulfate. Just a sip can be deadly, a mineral that lures with beauty but punishes with death. Some minerals can change history through the diseases they spread. Orpiment, another arsenic sulfide, was once used in medicine and even in art. But exposure to it over time causes organ failure. It was both a cure and a curse. Doctors who thought they were healing patients were often delivering them slow poison. And then there's moissanite. Not dangerous chemically, but misleading. Why? Because people confuse it with diamonds. In certain mining operations, the pursuit of moissanite has led to accidents, fights, and violence over stones that aren't worth what they seem. Sometimes, danger doesn't come from the mineral itself but from the obsession it inspires. But let's return to the truly deadly. Monazite, a mineral containing thorium, is dangerously radioactive. Mining it without protection exposes workers to long-term radiation sickness. Villages near thorium mines report high cancer rates. A single crystal in the wrong hands becomes an invisible weapon. Even quartz, one of the most common minerals on Earth, has a hidden danger. Cutting or grinding it releases silica dust. Breathe enough of it, and your lungs fill with scars, leading to silicosis. Workers in quarries often carried this death sentence without even knowing. Something so common, so ordinary, turning into a silent assassin. But perhaps nothing is more feared than polonium minerals. Polonium is so radioactive that even microscopic amounts can kill. It's rare, but when found in mineral deposits, it represents the ultimate threat. The poison used in modern assassinations traces back to these dangerous ores. Imagine a mineral capable of ending a life with a particle too small to see. That is the pinnacle of lethal elegance. And finally, the most dangerous mineral in the world isn't colorful, shiny, or rare. It's simple, invisible, and everywhere. Uranium ore, in its many forms, is responsible for nuclear energy and nuclear bombs. It has the power to light entire cities or erase them in a flash. The mineral that holds inside it both creation and destruction. It's the mineral that defines the modern age and the mineral that haunts our nightmares. So now, I'll ask you, which of these minerals shocked you the most? Was it the glitter of cinnabar, the deadly dust of asbestos, the explosive stibnite, or the radioactive glow of uranium?
Tell me in the comments, because I want to know which one left you thinking twice about the ground beneath your feet. If you enjoyed this journey into the 20 most dangerous minerals in the world, make sure to like this video, share it with friends, and subscribe to the channel for more incredible stories about the hidden powers of nature. Because in the end, these minerals remind us of a truth we often forget. The earth is not just beautiful. It is dangerous, powerful, and unpredictable. And sometimes, the deadliest things in life are the ones that shine the brightest.